Hey Exiles, Gassy TV here with another video. I wanted to talk about 3.11 speculations and thoughts, as well as showing you the bull build I've been playing during the last week. But before we dive into the topics of this video, I do want to announce that I'll be hosting a giveaway here for PoE MTX points in this video. And all you have to do is answer a question correctly and include your Discord tag so that I can add you to send you the key. The question itself is very simple. What's the only thing I liked about the bull build that I've been playing? So let's dive into the video. I want to have this video serve as the purpose of having a discussion as my opinions and thoughts of 3.11 and would love to hear you guys take on the upcoming release and what you're hoping for and also what you're expecting to do. Uh, so let me know in the comments below. Remember to subscribe for more content like this and more. Now the gameplay footage here in the background is from my Ice Shot Deadeye build I've made since we hit a recent goal on the stream forcing me to play an actual bow build as well as a melee build which I will be doing in the upcoming days here live on Twitch. Now my biggest issue with the bow builds in general is that they require for the most part, not always, but for the most part a pretty expensive and extensive investment before they start to feel very good to use, which is the main reason I've stayed away from them as most of my guides are designed to be leak starter friendly. However, the Void Fletcher Quiver providing Doom Bolts have been absolutely amazing and is without a doubt the only thing I truly liked about the build I played. It has been an amazing graphical design, as well as a booming, orgasmic sound to it as well. I will leave a link to my POB in the descriptions below, of course, if you'd like to take a look at it. So as we're enjoying the gameplay in the background, I want to talk about 3.11 speculations based on what we've heard from Bex so far. Now we know the logo colors, she has hinted about Vol Orbs as well as crafting. Now personally, I'm a big fan of crafting. I even have a bunch of videos and more to come in the topic, all linked in the descriptions below of course. Though no matter how much I enjoy crafting, I really hate to see them adding more orbs to the game. It's important to understand that most people playing the game doesn't use even half the orbs available to use. Some, being, some of these being things like essences, fossils, anal orbs and many many more. So by adding more orbs would just add to that list on top of the ever increasing currency tab not fitting the ones currently in the game as is. Now I'd love to see some sort of corruption crafting being in place, but I'd rather see that being gated behind leak specific crafting benches rather than sitting in your hideout buying the new orbs to then proceed with your crafting shenanigans as we are currently doing with most of the crafting processes. I'd love to hear you guys thoughts on this, so let me know in the comments below or no balls. Other speculations are about the colors of the league being translated to past leagues such as Synthesis, Delve or even Harbinger. Now I know Synthesis has been considered a horrific league by the community, but it has also proven to be the league with the best player retention in many, many years. Whilst leagues like Legion and evidently Delirium has had among the worst player retention of leagues in the game, so my question here is this, would you guys rather see a league in the spirits of Synthesis or would you rather see a Legion or Delirium-like league? My opinion here is heavily biased to the better player retention league as they make the game more enjoyable with more people actively playing and most importantly trading towards the end of the leagues. Now that's currently all we have on the 3.11 speculations and I hope you guys enjoyed my attempt at an actual bow build. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe for more content and I'll be picking out one winner per day till all my PoE MTX keys are given out here in the comments below. Now good luck to you all and as always exiles, till next time, stay safe and keep rocking.